In exercise 1, we will scan for secondary materials regarding the impacts of the Anthropocene to help aid in the process of imagining futures later on. As a group, you will evaluate one impact of climate change on Singapore. This evaluation may be done based on any one impact from the chart that is pinned on your desk, which is sourced directly from the National Climate Change Secretariat of Singapore. There may be more nuance to the impacts, but for the setting of this workshop, let's look at these in research for conceptualizing ideas for possible futures. Again, these futures are futures that might happen no matter how far-fetched, unlikely, or way out. The table serves as a guide on the type of information to look for in evaluating the impact of climate change. For instance, if you draw a reduction in biodiversity and greenery, and you've decided for event to be your mode of interpretation, you need to research for recent key events that has happened that are related to the reduction in biodiversity and greenery in Singapore. Likewise, if you draw expected rise in sea level, and if it is decided for trend to be your mode of interpretation, you then need to research for recent key trends that have happened that are related to the expected sea level rise. If you draw higher risks in the public health, and you've decided for system to be your mode of interpretation, you need to research for recent causes or policies that have happened that have perpetuated higher risks in public health. And lastly, if you draw intense weathers leading to water scarcity and you've decided for worldview or historical to be your mode of interpretation, you need to research for recent perspectives, myths, current knowledge, social causes and historical causes about intense weathers leading to water scarcity that have happened. These sets of guides are included at the bottom of the worksheet as well. Remember that these tables should serve as a guide rather than strict instructions to follow. Feel free to use the back of the worksheets to make notes should the front run out of space. You should use the internet to better help justify your research. In the last 10 minutes, as a group, choose the strongest two evaluations and write them on post-its and paste them at Horizon 1, Area 1. Now that you have some grounds of research for the impact that you were assigned with, we now move on to sketching quick ideas of possible imaginings that may be spinned off of your evaluations with the factor of possible futures in mind.